So is he doing work or is he asleep at his desk? I honestly can't tell. I don't know. He's very squinty. Wow, that's so mean. I mean, that's... He's a little turtle. You can't see that well. He has glasses, John. Yeah, but even with the glasses on, he's squinty. Yeah, but, but it doesn't if... matter. His vision's really bad. Don't make fun of blind people. I'm just saying, you would think maybe he needs to get a better prescription, because he's still squinting. Welcome back to some Sly Cooper Thievius Raccoonus. I am Comic. I'm Pad. And I'm still surprised that that's actually the subtitle of the game, but having a pretty good time right now. We finished all of, uh... All of France there. The squintiest, turkliest. No, that was uh, Wales. Oh, right. Yeah, it's just that the guy's name was very French. And we're going to Utah? It had been a while since I'd been back in the U.S. Next up, the notorious mugshot. Oh. With muscle of the fiendish thigh. What he lacked in brains, he definitely made up for in brawn. Is that a pug it with Turns a out it wasn't always that way. Hold on. He grew up as the run of the litter. <laughs> a neighborhood weakling. The only friends he could turn to were usually found on the big screen. <laughs> the dog father. He was there Stop that he that. spotted his first gangster, and he knew instantly that that's what he wanted to be. He spent the rest of his youth working real hard to get there, fueled on his dreams of great power and respect. With enough perspiration, he realized that dream. He'd become a hard-boiled, street-brawling, tough... I like how he, he aged the note the maids at all. Yeah. This was all in, like, the course of, like, two months. He buffed up <laughs> and... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. That's what happens when you start working out. You get your, uh, testosterone rolling. This is city, huh? I've always wanted to go to that thriving American boom town. Sly Cooper in. Sunset... Dice? Uh, snake. S sunset Snake Eyes. Sunset Dice? <laughs> it, the title took too slow. I wasn't able to deliver it properly. <laughs> Alright, and we got our van. Yep, so... Oh! Thanks, I earned a trophy for selecting the level. That's cool. Alright, so he's it's always... He's not a pug, he's a, he's a bulldog. Yeah. I don't know, they kind of look similar. Mm, he's, definitely, he's definitely a bulldog, though. I like that he was bullied because... Bullied. Yeah. He's a bulldog. And I like that I called him the runt of the litter because bulldogs are... Or pugs are kind of the runt of the dog world. This looks more like a ghost town. Something's happened. Where is everyone? I don't know, but it's starting to give me the creeps. What do you say we take off? And miss all the fun? Besides, I want to try out that new move I got from Raleigh's section of the Thievius Raccoonus. You mean the ninja spire jump? Yeah. Do me a favor and read me the instructions again. To land us safely upon diminutive points, leapeth lively and presseth the triggering device with the round geometrical object emblazoned upon it. So That's jump nice. beneath the circle button to land no. in narrow spots. That's a rough <laughs> Yeah. We, we were talking in a later episode about what John's persona would be. Oh, uh, well, I already messed up the spire jump, so there's the safe. Oh, no, this isn't the safe. I have to remind myself how this game is played. What was your what was your what was your persona? Um, I work one night and you have a persona when I come back. Yeah, welcome back, Ali, to Wait, there's two bottles. Where? Down down the bottom. Yeah, I know, but I need to use the spire jump or something. No, you don't. Oh. To get I, over to the rocks. Yeah. I get I don't know what this guy's gonna do yet. You could try and slam him from above. Yeah, I think that's what I wanna do. Yeah, John is a persona now? No, I don't. I don't remember what the animal was. I think it was something Because it like... didn't happen. Yeah, it did. I think, corrupted him. I think I suggested a koala. <laughs> yeah, you did. But I think... Oh, no. And then... Jo no, I said he was a badger. That's oh, it. Yeah. He's a badger. He is a badger, but I like koala, too. Be because I'm, like, super laid back. Yeah. I and could, and yeah. badgers are angry. I can't do this jump you right. And koalas aren't good at spire jumping, either. <laughs> no, but they're good at hanging. <laughs> well, you're not doing much of that either. Yeah, wait. Okay, he explained to me how to do it, but I wasn't paying enough attention because... You jump... Okay, so what do you do whenever you see blue sparkles? Um, you hold... Was it circle? So jump and hit the circle. Okay, and I just kind of magnetize to the point. Yeah. Cool. The same Assassin's Creed. 
It, it's kind of Assassin's Creed. It's like the start to... Oh, look at this dog on Elite. Okay, what's up with them? Most of the animals are anthropomorphic, but this freaking, like, Tom and Jerry bulldog is like a regular <laughs> dog. It's, He's slobbering. It's like Goofy and Pluto. Or like that one gargoyle from Gargoyles that was a dog. You never watched Gargoyles? Nope. It, they were all, like, could talk and stuff, but then one of them just acted like a dog. I don't know which way I want to go. Um, There's the water area. Over there. Because I want to collect everything. Oh. Okay, so I'm going to climb the thing, jump, hang off the thing, swing from the thing. It, another bulldog? I'm worried because I can only take one hit. Okay. And it just, like, slams back into infinity and... Oh! You surprised me there. Okay, what do I... Oh, no, not not the goggles. Um, I want the dive. Bam. Wrecked. You got your lucky charms. Yeah. Good, good, good. Now there's 40 bottles. So it's always, like, the first... The first level is just, like, getting to the hub. It would seem so. What's with those flashing lights? The latest in high-tech security... <laughs> Electronic floor sensors. Step on them and you're a goner. Nice touch. That's literally the latest. Frankly. But it also means they're about to switch. This was to in like 2006. Sector. Or 2002, actually. Maybe. Okay, alright. This was not a recent game. Oh! Okay, car tilts. That's fine. That's alright. Not you're safe. Okay, safe. I'm safe, and I get a safe. Mm -hmm. There's a bottle up there, and there's yeah. a bottle down in that water. Um, this is going to be a little tricky, I feel. Yeah. I guess I just got to balance real careful. Got to... I got to unleash my inner raccoon. Your inner badger. Raccoons are kind of like badgers. But I am neither of those things. Um, jump? No. I want. I want to go back and get. You can just jump down and land on one of those things. Do you, do you think I can land on it? Well, I mean, how good are you at jumping? Ah, uh, not, not very good, good apparently. Ah, shoot. I was even about to say like I have the lucky charm, so if I miss, it's all right. So I'll have to jump again. Yikes. Okay. Okay. Just look down. Jumping down should be easier than balancing. Can you tilt the camera? Um, can I? I can do that. You can't move the camera at all? I can only move it this way. I can't tilt it in the... In well, let's go. Oh, you can try and hit that wagon wheel straight ahead. Okay. Uh, oh! You're on, it. You're on it. Okay. You did it. Good. Okay, now you gotta go back that, uh, There's that, a couple. There's two. Yeah. See? Okay, back to the wagon wheel. And onto this wagon. Oh, there's four. Well, it's a good thing we came over here. Get that. I feel like the best thing is, like, last time you died, like, you didn't lose your bottles, so, like... Yeah, the bottles are forever. Bottles are forever. Friendships come and go, but bottles stay with you. Always. Oh, oh except you gotta get that last one. I thought he would... I thought he would cling. Did not. I thought he would cling to the end of the car. This isn't Titanic. You broke my heart, Sly. <laughs> this is not Titanic. There was one motor car on the Titanic. Yeah, that's beautiful. You want me to play it on the recorder? Oh. No thanks. <laughs> Though that is the most beautiful way to play that song. My favorite is Chop Suey played on the recorder. <laughs> My favorite is uh, Crocodile Rock mixed with Chop Suey. That's pretty funny, too. Can you imagine both Oh, those come mixed? on! Can you imagine on those two recorder. mixed on the recorder? <laughs> Dude, inspired. I'm going to do a mashup of those two. All right. I'm going to hold you to that. I have zero lives left. This is... Maybe you can go back that way. I mean, if I die, it'll start me at the beginning of the level where it'll actually be easier for me to get over there. You want a Sudoku? Sudoku? Yeah, Sudoku. <laughs> It's not what Sudoku is. Yeah, it is. Oh! Yep, I'm fine. I know you know that, too. 
Well, how do you know I know that? Because you're the one who speaks Japanese I out mean, of the I two of us. I don't anymore. <laughs> oh, you're forgetting all your Japanese? Yeah. I haven't studied in, like, years. Ah. I remember, like, individual words and stuff, but, like, not. Hmm. You should cling to that thing up there. You just gotta jump high enough. Okay, what if I run, jump? Yeah, yes! Yeah. The car tilts and makes me scared. Okay. We did it oh, without, without losing all of our lives. Oh, oh, I didn't hold cling. All right, hang tight, guys. We're going to get back. Super sneaky thief skill move. Your blue sparkles. Your, um... Yeah, the opium sparkles. Yeah, that's what I was trying to remember, the opium sparkles. Did you see the, um, the thumbnails at all for the Silent Hill? Yeah. And over time, I've been slowly... Adding Allie more and more to them. Oh, I didn't. I saw her peeking out for like a corner or two. Every once in a while, she comes out a, a little bit more from behind the sofa, like every few episodes. And also, like the ground gets covered in bottles. Oh, that's funny. That is funny. Okay, we're back. You should do. You should do like the length of it. Like, but depending on how long the let's play is, the more bottles just keep building up. Yeah. Like every episode, you have like two, and eventually you have like a hundred. Like if it's a really long one. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, that one had a ball and chain, but it didn't matter. Gets these bottles. And which way do it? Whenever there's a split in the road, I always like. Because I want to go the way I'm not supposed to go. That's how I feel about most games in general. Uh-oh. See this guy? Look yeah. Like he's holding a bunch of cards. Oh, is he going to, like, gambit at me? Whoa. All right. Uh, I think he did. Yep, he's a card slinger. Like, like, Twisted Fate or That's Gambit. Like Twisted Fate. Yeah. I mean, it's been a long time. Exactly. Or Yugi Moto. <laughs> he didn't throw cards. He threw cards down on the field, John. <laughs> in face-up attack mode! Um, so right now, in, like, Final Fantasy XIV, I've been playing, um, an Astrologian. Yeah. And they, they have a card deck that they use to give, like, players buffs. So I set macros that every time I use, like, one of my skills, it'll put in party chat a Yu-Gi-Oh quote. <laughs> That's pretty great. <laughs> so it's nice. time to did it did it it duel <laughs> Not so fast, Kaiba! <laughs> there are no pathetic. My grandfather's deck has no pathetic <laughs> cards, Kaiba, but it does contain the unstoppable Exodia. <laughs> I, I did that, and then one of the person, someone on our, uh, one of our DPS just disconnected. So the other DPS was just like, I guess he couldn't take the power of Exodia. He got <laughs> obliterated. It, it it wins instantly. Yeah. There was a time in the anime that. Kaiba threw his blue eyes white dragon card at somebody's hand to like make them drop the remote control to a bomb or something. Really? Yeah, like he actually threw the card. And and when he did it, he was like, "You're no match for my blue eyes." Oh my god. Which is weird because Ooh. in in that show, blue eyes was supposed to be like uber rare. So like, why would he throw that one? Well, there's that's where that is. You don't need to go there. Yeah. Oh yeah, because I don't have the bottles. I need, I need... We have bottles. I need that... <laughs> yep, we always have enough bottles here. We need Bentley to crack the code. There are some bottles to your left, though. Bottles to the left. See, bottles to the right. Those aren't connected to that thing. Oh. Okay, I was trying to figure out how to get across. I was like, that... that. I thought that... I thought you were... Honestly, I thought you had to jump. That crane had to be something. Yeah. All right, we're close. We're very close. I don't like when the save is in the... Be in the middle of the level, because it means I have to backtrack to it later. Uh, there you go. Okay. And around. <laughs> why do... Why do people always guard their bases with, like, randomly moving lasers and, like, weird... Mugshot, do you think Mugshot knows anything about security? No, he, do he doesn't look smart. Also... Like, Godfather is a good movie, but, like, why would it inspire you to get buff? There's nobody, like, really buff in that movie. It's the dog father, John. Oh, sorry. You don't uh, know. You okay, I, have, buff dogs. I haven't seen that movie. Yeah. <laughs> I've only seen the original Godfather. Yeah. The, the human variant. The dog, the dog father has significantly more uh, muscles. Okay. And pets. 
Oh, oh, I didn't mean to finish the level. Damn it's, it. It's fine. I think you can always go back. Yeah. I wasn't wait, even... maybe if you enter through the way you came, you'll be plopped down here. Oh, wait, no, you just... Oh, here, okay, you? I had to put it into the lock to end the level. Good, because I don't want to replay the whole level again. Well, we're missing four. Missing two. Yep. Oh, I forgot about the sounds his feet make when he walks. That's great. Um, it's sneaky sounds. Yeah. It's just the opium. You'd think it would make him less sneaky because, like, it's playing the soundtrack while but he walks. But isn't it like, isn't that like a James Bond thing, though? Like, yeah. Ding, 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 I'm not sure, like, you know, when he, like, steps, he, like, makes noise. I don't know. I, I know that's from the, something. Does James Bond do that? That sounds like something from, curious. like, that sounds like something from an old cartoon, like, Get Smart or something. That might be. I, I know, know I missed like that one. How do you miss the other one that you're missing? I don't know, but that one seemed pretty obvious. Usually they don't come in ones. Well, I mean, you were coming from the other angle, so you could just see it. Yeah. Look real carefully. Okay. Gotta be around here somewhere. Keep, uh, keep wondering if I could break those, but I can't. Look on top of that thing, too. I don't know, I didn't see anything. It's crazy. Or go to your left, look to your left. Um. Did you already get something there? Yeah, you did. Wait, did you go back and get that last one you didn't get before? Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. Wait, did I? Oh, oh no, wait, go down, oh, down, down, down. okay. That's that's pretty sneaky. Is it, is it Thievus Raccoon sneaky? Yeah. How do you get back now? Uh, there's a platform down there. No, there's not. No, it's. Okay, does that not look like a platform to you? But it's not near anything else. Oh, it, it's out of the map me. world. Can you jump up at all? Jump um, and double jump. Oh, I forgot there was a double jump. All right. <laughs> That's I, pretty important, John. I wasted my horseshoes. That's a very important beating tool. I wasted my horseshoes. I didn't oh. take my opium today. I We're forgot how to back. be a thief. We'll get them back. Yeah, alright, so let's get through here and end this level off. Mugshot just likes to decorate with... Like, how did a subway get up here? I don't know, John. It's It's been deserted. Like, a lot of shit's happened. Or, I guess it's a monorail. Is, is that... No, it's it's, it's it's Utah at the train. <laughs> there ain't no monorails. Doesn't That's look a like a regular train. It's a subway train. What is it doing in... The mountains. I also, there's like no sub. As far as I know, there's no subways in Utah unless maybe like yeah. Subway City. Yeah. I mean, but then again, this isn't directly. This is like anthro anthropomorphic America. Yeah, everything's furry, different. Yeah, furry America. Furry world. And yet the same. They're not too furry. Like they're furries not anthropomorphic fine. enough. Furries are fine as long as they're not sexualized, and that's that's my stance uh, on furries. Okay. Platonic, Perfectly fine. Just don't make them do something. <laughs> Perfectly and if fine. If you that, that's fine. Well, but just like shot, I'm, I'm not. Just, just okay. I just don't want to see it. <laughs> just but not in my house. Mesa City is a big place. Given that he's a bulldog, it seems only reasonable to assume. So do you think Mesa City is an analog for Salt Lake City? Maybe. I, when I th I'm thinking Las Vegas. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. But think of something. that's a totally perfect, like, that makes sense. Um, because this is Utah. Is Salt Lake City in Utah? Um, oh, how did you see me? I hit you. It doesn't matter. You killed him. Yeah, I guess so. Oh, I need to unlock the car. <laughs> so I'm going to need three more locks to get this. The car's still running, too. Yeah. That's a really weird tow job. There's another guy over there, by the way. Yeah. We'll get him. All of his people are dogs. He, it, it, it's the ultimate, like, rise from the bottom story. He employed all of the dogs that used to make fun of him. He's now top dog. The Boneyard. Dog-themed casino. Oh yeah. Let's do it. So this... This is cool. This is... I'm liking the aesthetic of this, yeah? Mm -hmm. Alright, so I've, we got a car. I've always liked something about that, like, Las Vegas game. Like, not even that. Like, I've always liked the kind of, like... Wow, actual ashtrays. Yeah. 
I've always liked the like adult sort of like you know what I mean like the classy but kind of dirty beneath the scenes but like trying to be classy with like all the all the yeah all the whoa missiles. Okay, I was not I was not ready for them. I, I need a mole again on that one. Like that's why I like um like the whole aesthetic of like Wolf Among Us. Mm, like you know what I mean? Cla like trying yeah. to be classy even though it's very like seedy. Kinda like the idea of like a strip club, kind of. You know what I mean? Like yeah. a gentleman's club. It's got like some this weird sort of class to it that's like very yeah. interesting. They gotta be reputable, quote unquote. Oh run they all kill run hide. They all hear me when I, when one of them hears me. Well, let's kind of home in on you too. Sure the bottles. Yeah, I need to go back for them. What happens if you hit the slot? Yeah, I don't think anything. Ooh, oh, there are bottles. I didn't know if there were bottles back there. I just was like, okay. Okay, I need to do something about They're these like dogs. They're like dancing around. Okay, yeah, they do kind of have a have a beat to them. I think if you hit them, if you hit them like before they. Yeah, before they can turn around. They didn't hear you breaking bottles off. Or killing their friend behind them. Yeah, for dogs, they don't have very good ears. Which is weird. Maybe they all have, like, those earpieces so they can communicate with each other, but it makes it harder for them to hear. That, that's, I feel like those okay, are blowing a dog. That's my head cannon. <laughs> I feel like the, wait. Those are different. Yeah, I feel like the, that would blow out a dog's ears, though. Well, like, well exactly. That's why they can't hear me. Their ears are blown out. So you gotta work to justify these things. Uh, what do we got here? What do we got? No. Okay, I guess I didn't miss anything. <laughs> He's got like pictures of like fire hydrants and stuff. <laughs> and what what is that steak? Yeah, it's a steak. It's like Juan. That's him. He's Ron Swanson. He's got pictures of steak on his walls. Fire hydrant. I feel no, like it's Juan just Swanson. a bus. It might be a bone. Oh, was it a bone? Just, it's a magnet. I think it's just the bone, like of a T bone steak. No, oh. it's just bone. Wow. But dogs would like meat, wouldn't they? Oh, yeah. bone. No, there's definitely meat around the T bone. Full T bone steak. Gonna get these pants. And then you can murder eat those dogs. I don't like murdering dogs. Oh, he turned around. He does kind of hear me. Oh! What happened there? I oh, get him, get him, bam. Hit him okay, again. hit him again, hit him again, quick. Lucky for me, I was wearing pants. Well, he's taunting. Break that whiskey bottle. Yeah. Um, anything else? I'll... Sunset sarsaparilla. Wait, yeah. did you get the ones that were on top of the? No, I gotta go back. Got that was another game that was really interesting. I like the the theme of. Mm, no more heroes. No Fallout New Vegas. No uh... Sunset sarsaparilla. Oh, I haven't played it. It's pretty. It's pretty solid. Two. It's a lot better when you have mods, because, like, it is kind of <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys, I'm allergic to dogs. Oh, my God. Actually? Yeah. And I so, love dogs. We have two dogs. Yeah. You could potentially jump and hit circle and, like, land back on it. Uh, I live and s <laughs> share a bed with dogs. <laughs> and you just die because of allergies. Nope. I, they're not very extreme allergies. He takes Benadryl sometimes. Yeah, they're, they're docile, though, and our, our dogs don't shed a lot. They're too tiny. Yeah. Dylan's Small family's spot. dog, though, like, can knock me out. He's a, he's the best dog. He's a great, he's a great dog, dog, but something about him, like, really sets off my allergies. Ah, oh. oh, shoot. Wait, I think you can get back. Oh. Well, Damn it. Good thing you died. Yeah, good thing I died. Rip. Ooh. That's fine. You gotta set real far back, though. It's fine, we can just blitz through this. Yeah. Well, the nice thing about doing this again was I didn't have to kill the dogs as much. I mean, I mean, Sly doesn't ki kill people. He he knocks them out. Uh -huh. He incapacitates them. What game was it that you do that? Well, in Pokemon Faint, that's the first thing yeah. I'm thinking of. That's good. And, ah, oh, don't land in the light. Well, well, Anybody else see me? Okay, nope, just him. Got this there's rotating. There's some stuff back there. There's like a little. What? What on earth even is this? Wait, there's a lot of bottles around here. Yeah. They've been putting more and more bottles into every level lately. So if I climb Wait, this thing, thing, oh, there's it's a hook. a hook. 
Okay, I was thinking there's got to be some reason why this is revolving. Oh! That's a really strange jackpot. Where the only goal is to, like... And you win always. You always win, but it's hard to pull the lever. Sounds like some kind of, like, ironic monkey's paw sort of thing. But you don't have to pay. <laughs> Oh, there's one to your left. Alright, cool. It, it's a slot machine that you always win, but you can't pull the lever. Like, like one of those things That's like... vandalism. Like, you'll be a master of every instrument, but you'll be deaf. Like one of those sort of things. Hey man, Beethoven was deaf. Yeah, he wasn't when he started composing music, though. True. Oh god. Unfair. There's Unfair. A lot of things to throw at you, isn't it? Yeah, but I'm a master thief, so it's fine. Unless I unless it count unless it counts jumping. Yeah. You know, lots of thieves do this without jumping. I don't I don't wanna I don't wanna run like under Munchot's legs. Bigger. Yeah. Leg day, man. Okay. Obligatory leg day joke out of the way. And we can move. I also, just like a game feel thing, I like how Sly keeps running forward when I swing my weapon. What do you mean? Why wouldn't he? Well, like, take like Link, for example. Link kind of comes to a standstill when you swing the sword. It depends on what game you're on. Yeah. The newer games he doesn't. That's true. I I'm thinking more like Ocarina of Time. But I like that it's like this. I like it. Oh well, yeah, I guess like Link to the Past he didn't, but Ocarina of Time I think he did. Yeah, Majora. I think those are the only ones. Wait, maybe Wind Waker? Does he in Wind Waker? Oh, wow, this... Yeah. Kind of. Yeah, Wind Waker he stops, Twilight Princess he stops. No, he doesn't. He doesn't? He doesn't oh, I Princess. didn't... I didn't see that! Might not... Ooh. Oh, and it turned back on? Un this is... Yeah. He gotcha. You just been got. Wow, I'm really bad at roulette. You just been got. Oh, wait, you got the life. Wait, is there something up there? No, that's electrified. Yeah, I'm just I'm just looking, seeing if there's that's anything. electrificated. <laughs> it has really high electricosity. Electrification is the correct term, John. Just like coin collector is the correct term. <laughs> For a coin collector. I realize what that term is now, too. It's numismatist. That's it. <sighs> See, I knew it was a thing, and I wasn't crazy. When I try to think of that, I think of Philagalist, which is stamp collector. He's a coin collector. He's just a coin collector, John. Come on, come on, bouncy. What are these supposed to be look like? They're like chandeliers, that's but they... Thing, like, that's a C, and the other one was an S. Um, it's dollars and cents signs, dude. Oh my god, really? Yeah, that's what those are. Oh, that's so painful. He Ooh. likes money. Using my slowdown he ability. He's a test. Yeah. <laughs> I guess I am too, because I like having money. <laughs> I feel like it's more than that. I feel like it's people who, like, obsessively want money. Yeah. Just, like, no, who, want like, money want certain coins. But not even that. It's just, like, people who, who want money just for the sake of having money. Like, yeah. they don't plan on spending it. Let's called being a hoarder, I guess. How did the casino get flooded? L Mugshot, get your house in order. It's not a very popular casino. Yeah, apparently not. Because the Luke's... The, uh, the Luke... Wow, the roof has been leaking. You can sure that. has. You could probably just run through it and then activate it and, like... If you're close yeah. to the siren, you can hit yeah, the Yeah, I might as well just go. This is, like, his secret base, but it's also, like, a casino, so who comes Ooh, here? One... It must be, it must be after. It must be close. There it is. Yeah. Okay, we got all of them. One hundred percent. Oh, we didn't get the hundred percent in the last episode, though. In the last, not the last episode, the last area. Yeah, we did. Did you go back and get it? What oh, I it? didn't do the safe. Dang it! I I got all of them, but I didn't remember to go collect the safe. Okay. Um, how do I? Yeah, get closer to it. To I right. forget what button to press. There we go. Oh, he's getting so swift. I'm getting so swift, dog. Okay. Yeah, Benley had a rough life on the streets, but it made him hard. The, in the streets of the orphanage. Twenty-four <laughs> percent. I can't believe I forgot to open the safe. 
in the other level. <laughs> right. Top of the morning. <laughs> oh, this might help you if like guards that are tough, tough to get rid of. Yeah. Because they're on a trap and wait in their path. Huh. Let me give that a try. Let me give that a flip of the old hat. Exploding hats. Ooh. Oh wow, that's a huge blast <laughs> radius. I didn't think I didn't think the blast radius would be that big. There's no indicator. Let's try this. Kilt proceeds to kill himself. God. No, don't open the. Uh. Okay. This is a weird roulette board. I didn't know of roulette boards that also have like yellow on them. Yeah. Who? Because that th those those ones are yellow, right? Yeah. They're not red because there's red, but there's also yellow. Like. Who is your clientele? Dogs. Dogs are colorblind, so they wouldn't know the difference. Whoa. Yeah, but then you'd have a bunch of dead patrons. Why would they be dead? Because there's electric. Because that's everything's not... electrocuting. John, that stuff's not on when the casino's open. Oh, so am I just here after hours? Well, there's nobody here. You gotta land on the black. You gotta play roulette with your body. Gotta land on green. Oh, oh boy. Ooh, that was close. Okay. Jump. Long jump. Do it. No, short jump. Short jump takes me to or two or sometimes three. Alright. One more. And long jump. Oh, long jump. Oh, long like jump. Oh my head. Uh short jump. Short jump. Short in. jump. There you go. Got it. Get that key. Whoa! <laughs> I love how he's not spinning, even though the platform is standing on his. Yeah, I don't know. I guess it. I he guess the platform. Too. The platform itself is spinning in the opposite direction, though, so it stays in the same place. But he would spin. Not if the platform, because it's like, it's like how a helicopter keeps like. The part you sit in in a helicopter keeps from spinning. That's because it's not attached to the... Well, because you got two propellers on a helicopter spinning. Okay. So there's a rotational force acting against the first rotational force. Uh, That's how the platform this works. This is too science -y. So next time on Sly Cooper, we'll have some more science and some more some more physics. Some more safe opening. Sly science. <laughs> Slyance. Mm -hmm. mm. Does it sound like there's some kind of food? Mmm, can't wait to get me some tasty slants. That, that sounds gross. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, God. I wouldn't recommend it. With a side of slies. Ooh, there's another way. Everywhere I go, I'm killing dogs.